teacher that made the biggest impact on me was Mrs. Opal Price. She was my fourth grade teacher. And up until that time, I was a pretty hard student to deal with, I guess. That would be a nice way to put it. I got paddled just about every day. My third grade teacher nicknamed me Hardhead because they couldn't get along with me. But Mrs. Price was the first one who figured out to give me an IQ test. And it came back and she called me in her office. She said, you're bored to death. We're not making you work hard enough. And so she started giving me extra assignments and she started doing some other things. But she invested into my life and took the time to find out what was going on. 20 years later, when I was 27 years old, uh, I was named the head basketball coach at Durant High School, girls basketball coach. Three days later, I get a letter in the mail and I open it up and it's from Mrs. Opal Price. And she said, John, I just want to tell you how proud I am of you and I always knew that you would be successful and I just want you to know that I'm, I'm proud of what you're doing. Later on when she got older and retired, I found out that she'd been moved into an assisted living center. So when it came Christmas time, my wife and I and my son, who was a little bitty at the time, I told my wife, I said, we're going to go out and see Mrs. Price. She's not going to spend Christmas by herself. So when we got there to the assisted living center, I got out of the car and went up to the door. We couldn't get into her room because there were 30 or 40 other people waiting to get in to see Mrs. Price too. And a lesson that I learned from Mrs. Price is that if you do this job well, and if you understand that teaching is more than just teaching kids, but it's loving kids and building relationships, then through the lives of others, teachers have a chance to live forever. And Mrs. Price will always live through me because of what she did in my life and so many other people too.